Hi people, Punky here, welcome back to this channel. In this episode we have a review for Tier 1 Italian light tank Fiat 3000. <laughs> that is actually French. And we will do this review from two main parts. First this shot in garage part and then three awesome games. One mine, one uh, live random game and one of your best games in this uh, tank. So let's start with appearance of this tank like you can see it is very small tank especially frontally it is very narrow so small target it looks cute but not cute as original ft17 so uh let's compare it with a benchmark for size on this channel my red t34 you know which is something like a normal size tank and yeah when we compare it with ft it is you know <laughs> it is obvious how small this uh, one is i don't know how people even fit inside but they were you know because this was uh, first modern tank well actually that ft 17 original version and this tank has two guns in selection first one is stock and garbage and second one is 37 millimeters 40. Uh, this gun has 21.4 rounds per minute rate of fire which is uh, pretty okay for uh, tier 1 and this kind of gun 39 millimeters of penetration with this standard AP runs 60 millimeters of penetration with this gold again AP runs not APCR or heat this time and don't use HE runs on tanks uh, that is guns below 75 millimeters in caliber so this gun has a very good gun depression especially in compare with FT you know original one and it is punchy nice uh, little gun pretty accurate for tier one you know uh, so uh, what about armor you have 16 millimeters all around on turret and hull and on paper that looks really bad but in reality you will bounce all shells that going on these side panels here and here and even here sometimes on side it is very much open and everything will pen you there and on rear it is like combination of those two so uh, speed and driving uh, this tank is very slow speed is uh, unknown word for this tank uh, except when it's falling down the cliff uh, so it is slow like uh, Otsu NC31, Rinald FT and rest of the family uh, and what about uh, equipment, uh, ammo and uh, crew on this tank? Well, like you can see, I'm using binoculars for increased view range, you know. Uh, so I will spot enemy tanks on bigger or longer range. Uh, gun length drive uh, for quicker aiming, like we said already. So I will aim quicker, so I will be more precise. And uh, come on it uh, for concealment, you know. So um, I will negate that enemy view range, so I will remain unspotted for longer or more often, depends from situation to situation. And uh, ammo wise, well, I don't need to use all 141 uh, rounds, you know. I don't need to carry them because I cannot use them all. Uh, so you're using around 50 rounds uh, AP, 14 rounds gold AP and don't use the HE rounds on uh, calibers be be below 75 millimeters. Uh, so uh, let's see now that awesome gameplay. Yay. Okay, our first game, of course, Abbey Map or Monacy. And uh, let's see what this uh, Fiat 3000 uh, aka uh, Renault FT can do. So, I think maybe this gun is uh, more similar to that one on NC31, you know, and uh, it's somehow better, you know, that uh, T1 doesn't know how to drive so he decided to to turn my tank and this is how slow things are in Fiat 3000 you know big name but 
small tank, small performance. Oh man, even medium one is faster than me. That is so sad. And a little tractor and MS 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 one MS MS one. They are much much faster and better tanks. And there is Kologusenka, you know. Kologusenka is uh, one terrible tank with uh, pretty good gun for tier uh, tier one. I love that gun. No. So it was above average damage for us there. 47 hit points. Remember, it is 40 uh, in average. And here next to us we have Otsu, Rinaldo Otsu. Heaviest uh, and longest version of FT-17. Okay, unfortunately that uh, didn't went in. Okay, now that Kologusenka is down. Oh, we, we have spotted tanks all the way there. Medium 1 is spotting, but we are still spotted too. Oh no, Otsu is here actually, okay. Otsu is here and a uh, low tractor was there and that was one we can say lucky shot there. In his commander's hatch. It was like a clutch shot, you know. So speaking about clutch shots on this tank, it is not impossible, you know. We will do it. Oh, there is one enemy tank. No one uh, left on the right, you know. No one left on right. So there you go, low tractor and 40p. 40p we had that tank. Uh, in one of previous reviews pretty capable gun with uh, also terribly slow aiming time like on a heavy tank but you can you know do it with that tank and there is another 40p of course, I see many players using auto gun on uh, 40p. Like I said, it is not bad, but uh, uh, just if you want to play several games, you know, and to go on other things. If you thinking seriously about the 40p, 40p, sorry, then. Um, you should uh, use single uh, gun, you know, single shot gun. So here we're struggling for shot on that uh, lol tractor. And uh, we are not stuck here, we are just trying to climb there. You know. So trying to get shot on him. Now we are spotted, and there he is. Okay, he is using that auto gun. Hit that auto gun. It is inaccurate, but uh, it looks like it's uh, it will never stop shooting, you know. So we lost their driver on moment, but we uh, fix him. And just three tanks left now, we are on five kills, you know. So now climbing on small slope, like you can see, is big problem for Fiat 3000, like for every FT. Well, actually, original FT uh, has different gear ratio, so it will climb very uh, nicely. He will not lose much of his speed, you know, but he doesn't have speed. Uh, so, my point is, it will be equally slow going uh, on level ground or 
up the hill. So that was uh, 4 TP, destroyed 6 kills and top gun for uh, this tank. We are careful here because Otsu has a pretty powerful gun and depends from roll maybe he can even uh, one shot me now not really sure about that but there you go 20 21 kilometers per hour for water speed some tanks have same same speed in reverse you know so where is that otsu it is possible that he didn't move from that uh, position on F2. Oh, he did. Okay. So Otsu is uh, something like heavy tank uh, in tier 1, you know. It has uh, biggest armor. When first time appeared, you know, and uh, gold uh, wasn't for... You couldn't buy uh, the special runs, you know, that we call gold for uh, silver it was really a uh, trouble to you know pen that uh, you know also especially when he is moving you know but uh, let's see you know in situations like this you never know is uh, all this uh, all this traveling you know for nothing you know you're so slow and you're going and going you know never to reach your goal and it can happen that he will die just now when i am so close there you go 4 tp using auto gun really not also moving to this one is on two kills like you can see i using bushes to approach him just in case and there he is now we proxy detecting each other but it is too late for him reloaded go rounds we chuck him and kill him seven kills for fiat 3000 so is uh, Fiat 3000 best FT-17? Well, I don't think so. I still think NC-31, if I remember good, is better. But it is close, you know. So let's see post-game data and then let's see, let's see one live game with a live commentary. Okay, so we own 7,000 credits, 34 shots far, 20 on target, okay, Shark QRC8, tanks damage and we kill 7, team score, set on experience, we are first in that with 870 stars of experience, 7 kills, first in that 2, and 691 HP of damage, first in that 2. So let's see personal score, we got Top Gun, 4 for fact Duelist, Bruiser and M badge for this tank and this, this uh, game. So let's see one live random game. Okay, so let's uh, play that live random game with live commentary and hopefully that will uh, give you better perspective on this tank. Uh, maybe more good and bad things about this uh, tank. Uh, you will hear my uh, thoughts in real time and hopefully uh, that will help you if you are a beginner. Also, whatever I doing in this game, uh, nothing is uh, by accident most of the time, you know, at least I'm trying. So if I select certain path, certain tactics, if I knock out uh, three uh, whatever I do, usually I do it for good reasons, so you can maybe copy that, but this is Himmelsdorf now. So, there is no many options here. And it is tier 2 match, you know. Very hard tier 2 match, so it will be tough. You don't want to go in this slow... Uh, tank on hill usually you know most of the times 
so we'll try to defend banana here on 8 line 7 and 8 and let's just see we have one Russian low pitched uh, T60 tank you know that is really slicky tank okay there is M2 you know molesting other tanks okay molesting other M2 well that is good so here they have much better tanks you know so I don't know is it smart here to sit and exchange fire with them but I will put that one <laughs> and I will run oh no I will maybe wait here so I can shoot that that M2 M2 with gold rounds oh this this round is so slow this round is so slow I want to run away you know and another M2 is joining the crew wall tractor there that T60 is gone I'm trying to find better position for defense now Okay, one and two less. That's good. We still have M2. But just look how slow this aiming time is. That low tractor bet has better one. And better rate of fire too. So is he able to shoot me from there? I'm still on AP rounds. Uh, gold AP rounds. Okay. Okay, I will risk even through that to shoot him. Okay, they are pushing actually. There is another Fiat 3000 there. That one is dead. Cruiser is one that worries me, but uh, let's go close and maybe I can get that one. Whoa! Actually, wall tractor killed cruiser. Can I finish this Fiat 3000? You know, what is that tank? I never saw that. What is that one? So you see there, my uh, commander sketch is on good side. He his was there, so I saw his first. But that is not only reason. He was closer to obstacle, and one further from obstacle will always see, you know, better. Okay, avoid, avoid. Oh, <laughs> medium one was behind me, you know. So they still have T7 car, he can still do it, you know. We still have medium 1, we can still do it. So this is risky now. i hoping that T7 car actually went to DK, you know. And uh, I will not even go there, I will join with my medium 1 here. So hopefully the T7 car, I don't know who drives that uh, tank still. Yes, he went to the cap. That is good cruiser. Unfortunately, on the wrong side. How many hit points he didn't saw in time? I don't know. Where is that medium one? He's probably waiting for us on the other side. Hopefully, he will not one shot me here. Okay, let's go like this. 
And then... Where is that dude? People. Where is he? Is he in garage? Let's check garage. Must be in garage. Hopefully we can kill him before this and car comes and then... Whoa, he's not in garage, he's there. Whoa, that sneaky son of the tank. You know? So now is a uh, question where T7 car went. Is he again on hill? Does he going here? Oh no, we lost T2 medium. This can be very dangerous now. Crossing here on open from hill. Let's just hope. Whoa, I should block him there. I didn't realize my medium is capping actually. Okay, T7 car is going to decap now again. Yes, well, a low tractor is capping actually. I confused a little bit here. And he managed to cap. <laughs> so that was that. Too bad I couldn't put one round in that uh, T7 car. I made mistake there. I should go straight over that uh, medium one. But I was again thinking maybe T7 car went on hill. Then he can shoot me from sides. And uh, I wanted to catch that medium one, you know, with uh, his uh, guard down. But it was okay, you know, just to show you, you are slow. Uh, your gun, when you fully aim, works very well despite accuracy. But when you uh, waiting for that full aim, well. You will wait for a really long time, so even with gun lane drive, uh, I cannot even imagine how it is to people who who playing this. Well, I can imagine I was playing without gun lane drive and other equipment too. We all started once, you know. Okay, your best game in this tank. Uh, it is game from uh, Denton uh, Rasmus. I don't know. Uh, so he has some weird camo here, you know, it is ugly shit and I didn't know that you could uh, You could uh, put this uh, stay home sticker uh, On your tank Well, I wouldn't do it, but uh, I didn't know it is in existence, you know So let's see Dento Denton then Ton, what he will do in his uh, Fiat 3000? Well, he definitely ruined this tank with this camo, but uh, let's uh, enlarge this uh, mini map. No, it is not so mini, you know. And luckily for him, it is still one uh, match, you know. But this tank isn't very good uh, for tier 2. Not uh, because of gun or armor, just because of speed, you know. If you have uh, enough speed, you don't need so much armor because you will find cover for yourself, you know. Uh, but this uh, slow tank, you know, if you get yourself on open even this big and they're shooting at you, it's hard to escape. Let's see. They have a lot of cruisers, you know. Cruiser 1 is now tier 1 tank. Used to be tier 2. And there is low tractor, you know. Low tractor is like different league, you know. It has so much a better a ratio between mobility and uh, power power. Though it is uh, awkward to drive that uh, tank. You know, it is like... Like having uh, your 
tank on broomstick, you know, and uh, then you're trying to to navigate your tank through this map with a broomstick. Wow, that was uh, some nice shooting here. He loaded full amount of ammo, but no gold for him. The low tractor was shooting gold, like you can see one of them. So another Fiat 3000, he decided to detract him like that the dude wanted to go somewhere. Oh, he should probably concentrate to shoot equally in commander and driver. That would be enough. Three kills for him. And uh, mostly he did everything uh, alone, you know. But behind him is Cruiser 1. Cruiser 1 was boring tier 2 tank, very slow one, but uh, Pom Pom Gun was uh, working so nicely on that Cruiser 1 that uh, I was uh, somehow enjoying in that tank. Of course, wow, Amorak, far work for you in this review, just from Punky, yay. Well, actually, with help of uh, Denton and his Fiat 3000. Okay, that also going up. Very slow, very dead. Five kills. Ooh, that is good. Five tanks left. Let's see how many he will kill. Usually when I say that, it is big amount. <laughs> but, okay, don't hope. Uh, so, yay, you can drive this tank, like you can see, even without gold. Why he using a tree runs? I don't know, you know. But probably he just grabbed this tank uh, with uh, stock load, you know, from factory. <laughs> uh, but you don't need more than 50 runs. I can bet uh, in that, you know. And uh, for sure, those gold rounds can help uh, sometimes. Though they can be, you know, trollish too. 60mm C is not a lot, you know. If you hit gun mantle, you will not pan it. Uh, especially if. On tanks that have gun mantles, you know. Okay, cruiser is on the right. Yes, ah, okay. There you go. Dead. Six kills. Six kills. A lot of skills. Three tanks uh, to go, but he is spotted. And there is lol tractor on four kills, and he is not in middle anymore. So. Either he is here near that tower, a church, whatever, church. Either he is uh, in that uh, bush on A eight. Okay, another Fiat three thousand just sitting there. Is he even shooting? I don't know. And like you can see, if you aim fully, most of your shots are another forward for you. Come on, guys. This deserves like and hit on that uh, bell icon, you know. Okay, 8 kills for him. Just low tractor left. Uh, he is on 4 kills. Does he have shot? A little bit up, 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 up. And that dude is dead. So... Never mind, 8 kills and almost 1000 HP of damage for tier 1. That is pretty amazing result, you know. So let's see post game that and who did what. Okay, Denton earned 10,000 credits in tier 1. That is pretty epic. Uh, 29 shots fired, 25 on target. Great accuracy, really. 8 and 7 and he killed 8. Uh, let's see team score, set on experience. Uh, first in that with 679 stars of experience, 8 kills by far better than anyone else and 973 HP of damage, first in that uh, 2 in both teams, 2 tanks uh, spotted, 
A top gun for him, far for effect duelist, uh, demolition expert, two times bruiser and ambage for this tank and these games. So that was uh, pretty nice. Now let's just see that final question and answer uh, like always in this review. And that question in the end, should you keep this tank or sell it as soon you unlock next one in line? And my answer is, it is still one tank, it is very slow. Yes, you have 70% to ratio in it, you can do some good stuff in it, but after all, it is slow tier 1 tank, so my answer is no, don't use one. And even if you want to uh, use um, tier 1 tank for start padding or seal clubbing, or anything, don't use Fiat 3000, it is boring tank, use something that is faster uh, and better like MS1 or a LOL tractor, that German one, uh, or even uh, American T1. So, uh, that is that, uh, don't, don't, uh, don't stick with this, this uh, tank because it will cost you time and uh, in-game money, and uh, your nurse, you know, and it will still be slow, you know, uh, stupid tank. So now for this one, I hope this uh, review was useful for you. What to say, thank you for watching, subscribe, like, uh, uh, ring that bell, and uh, check my Patreon too. Uh, thank you for watching, and see ya.